hello thanks for tuning this video so in this video we will see how to renewal DP203 which is Azure Data Engineer certification which is easy and we'll see how we can do that so Azure Data Engineer certification is DP203 previously we have DP201 and DP200 together but now if we give just dp203 we can get azure data engineer certification um, so once you have completed the certification it will have validity for one year so after one year the certification will expire so in order to renew that certification you will receive an email 180 days before the expiration of the certification so i'll show you how the email looks like so this is how it looks like so you will receive an email uh, before 180 days and which gives the details about the renew certification link and so it also gives instructions about the renewal assessment and first thing is you don't need to turn on the camera and you just need to prepare what are the changes they'll give a set of uh, modules which needs to be brushed up and also you can take multiple items for example first time you have taken the exam you didn't pass immediately you can take the second attempt however if you fail that two attempts then you have to wait for 24 hours to reappear the exam so that's the condition so let's see let's click this particular link renew cert your certification so it will redirect to the our account the learn.microsoft account so here the information about check my eligibility in profile so for this you have to log in to the same email id through which you have given the exam initially so this is very important that uh, when you write the exam through the corporate email id don't forget to link your personal email id so that even if you leave the organization you can have the your personal email id to renew your certification right right so so here are the basic video how to renew with simple steps So let me click on this check my eligibility in profile click that and it will show you the information about the badges and the previous information so I have two certifications here however the data engineer for example Azure data fundamentals it will not expire it will be a lifetime validity however if we are if you have taken the data engineer exam it will expire within any year so you have to renew it so this expires on March so once you take this exam renew the exam and you pass the exam it will be extended to 3rd of March 2024 so click on renew and you can take the exam so before that uh, so you can see how what are the modules which you need to cover so just click on the renew button here once you click that it will show that you know the renewal for Microsoft and it expires in so and so days so I'll also do a video once I complete the certification of Azure data engineer so they will give the renewal assessment so they will talk about azure data factory azure signups analytics the spark as well as the azure cosmos tv the especially the azure signups link and the best practices in azure signups analytics the workloads and data warehouse using this data azure signups analytics yeah well, you can click on the take renewal assessment and it has 45 minutes and it's free you don't need to turn on the camera so just press up your concepts and give the exam just take the exam take 
click on the take renewal assessment so I'll click in the next one um, I'll click this later that goes to the exam and you have different modules here so for each of those click here so these are the modules which needs to be completed that's it and uh, in the previous video I have missed to give this uh, information that you know once you click on the virtual you know to get a free Microsoft uh, Azure, Azure fundamental certification you can click on this training days and you go to this particular thing and if you click on this link it will open this Azure the registration page where you have to provide the registration details here and register once you register that then you'll receive an email, email confirmation with the dates and uh, the link to join the session once you complete that session you will receive an email with a voucher so that you can attempt the exam free of cost so that's it for today's um, session and thanks for listening to the video if you have learned something new today please like my video do subscribe and comment on my video thanks for listening have a great day you take care